Hey everyone, welcome back. Today's video is the Project Polish finale. Um, I'm just gonna excuse my voice. I'm feeling a little under the weather. Uh, but my voice is obviously very cracky and stuff, so sorry for that. But um, this is the finale, and I'm just gonna go through real quick and show you the ones that I finished and then just what the end result is on these polishes. So I picked out 11, well 10, and then one was like a more of like a decorative nail polish. Um, but I pretty much started with, on the whole, all full size bottles. Uh, so yeah, so let's just get started. So the first one is this green stripe right. Uh, this was like, yeah, like I said, this is just like a decorative one. This is by So Easy. And honestly, I didn't even use it. It just, it was too dry. I did purchase the nail thinner from Sally's and it didn't make any kind of a difference. So this one really wasn't even, it just didn't even have a chance to begin with. I mean, the brush is all frayed and everything. So I'm not even going to include this in totals. This is just going to be a throwaway. Um, one that I did finish was this one, and this was a no-name one, but I did start over here, and there is nothing left. I mean, I put nail thinner in it a couple of times just to get out a couple of more, like, polishes or, like, accent nails, but it's just way too gloopy now. You can't get anything really out of it. So, this is done. And sadly, I won't be able to give this a price because I don't know who it's by because there's nothing on it. That stinks, but whatever. <laughs> the last, the next one that I finished is by this Naturistic Super Shine, and this is in the color Iced Aubergine Pearl. Now, I started with here, and this is like my first update. This is my second, and there's a dot at the bottom, but nothing, again, where I could really get out and do like a whole nail or just, you know, an accent nail. There's like really nothing coming out, so... That is done. And then the other ones I didn't finish. I wasn't able to finish, but some of them I did make some progress on. So I'll start with the ones that I really made no progress on. This is the Sally Hansel, Sally Hansen Hard as Nails in the color Champagne. I started here, and this is where I'm ending up with. I really didn't use this one too much after, you know, the summer passed. So... That is it, but I am going to keep that because I really do like the color. Um, let's see. The next one where I really didn't make any progress on is this one. I usually just use this as an accent nail. I did start, I think, with the whole bottle, but this is where I'm ending up with. I, I never did my, you know, a whole full, a whole manicure with it. It would always be like one or two as far as like an accent nail, so <clears throat> I didn't go through that one um, too much. The next one is the Top Speed, and this is in the color Glitz and Glam. Again, I use this more for an accent. I believe I started with a full bottle. This, I think, was my first update, and this is where I am now, or stopping at. And again, I mean, I'm going to keep these because I, I do like the colors. I mean, none of these I'm going to get rid of, so. <clears throat> the next one is Merlot, and this is by Sally Hansen. I started with a full bottle. And this is where I am right now. I didn't use this one too much. This is what I'm wearing on my nails right now. This is by Sally Hansen, and this is called Wind Up. And let's see. I started, I think, with a full bottle. This was one update, and this is where I am right now. And then... This is by Revlon, and this is Sugar Plum, and this basically has the same <laughs> progress over it was from last time. And this is Vinique. This is the color Reels of Fun. Yes. So I start with the full bottle. This was one update, and this is where I am now. And my last one is probably the second one that I made the biggest progress on, besides finishing that one color, is the Sally, Han Sally Hansen Digital. Um, it's like a hot pink color. It's a, I love this color. Uh, but I started with a full bottle. 
this was one update and this is where I'm stopping at. So, obviously I don't feel like this was a success since I was only really able to finish up two polishes that I started with. This one, like I said, is going to be thrown away, so I really didn't get a chance to use that one at all. So, I'm sort of feeling that this was a fail, but I'm not upset. I still got some use out of my nail polishes, and it just goes to show me what I learned from it is that this kind of a project polish, or the way that this project is for polishes, is just not for me. Um... I was noticing, especially because there were like a couple of months where I did buy a lot of new nail polishes and I just felt like I couldn't try them because I had to work on these. So there were like a couple of months where I really didn't touch too many of these because I really wanted to try the new ones. So I do have a better idea. I'm still going to do a type of a, like a project polish for next year, but I'm going to do it in a way where I think it's going to suit, you know, me. Uh, I too, I get very bored easily, so even though this was a variety of colors, there was like 11, I just, I want to be able to use all of them. So I sort of, you know, thought of a way that I could go ahead and do it for next year where I think it's going to work for me. So I'll probably be filming that, I don't know, maybe I'll film that after this one, but I'm probably not going to post it until like the new year. But um, yeah, so that's it. I hope you guys are doing well on your project polishes. Your polish projects, your polish projects. I'm sorry, I'm not feeling good. I'm like out of it. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys are all doing well, and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a blessed day, guys. Bye. Mwah.